This is the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce. Troy Davis, a death row inmate awaiting execution on Wednesday, was denied clemency by the Georgia State Board of Pardons and Parole. Mr. Davis's lawyers pleaded on Tuesday during their last effort to prevent his death by lethal injection. The members of the board rejected the lawyers' claims of shaky witness testimony and lack of physical evidence that they believed cast enough doubt about his guilt to spare him death. 42-year-old Davis was convicted for the killing of Mark McPhail, an off-duty police officer, in a Savannah parking lot in 1989. The case had garnered national attention, sparking protests and more than 630,000 letters asking for the board to grant him clemency and spare his life. The McPhail family has a different view, believing he should be put to death because of the already guilty verdict. New evidence that placed another man at the scene and an affidavit from a witness implicating another man in the shooting were brought to the table in recent years. The case was even brought to the Supreme Court, preventing his execution in 2008. However, the court never saw the case. Davis is set to be executed tomorrow by lethal injection. If he was granted clemency, he could have spent life in prison without the possibility of parole. For more updates, stay tuned. You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce.